Hi, this is Heather from Beauty and Truth Math. Today, Emily and I have 12 big announcements as we head into the 2023 school year. So let's get started. The first thing we want to let you know about is that we have updated in new products. Practical geometry is done. You guys, anytime you use this guide and love it, please send Emily thank yous because she has worked so hard on this. So both years are now updated in the format we started using last summer and they are streamlined to flow cohesively together. Emily has added videos and thorough answer keys and we think you're absolutely gonna love it. I just wrapped up completing the elementary algebra bundle. So this is our first guide written to the students with a bit of teacher involvement. And then next year's algebra guide will be written to the student, all future guides for that matter, will be written to the student with teacher involvement, but this is kind of an in-between um, transition year for our students. So that is now available as a bundle and completed with updates. Thank you for the feedback on typos and corrections and questions that were sent to me. Those were all very helpful in finishing this product. All right, the year six arithmetic guide is also done. This is our capstone year of arithmetic for our form one and two students. We use it to summarize a ton of things they've learned in the first five years. It's only three days a week and the lessons are intentionally a little bit shorter because this is the first year if students are following the exact pacing of our guide where their elementary algebra and practical geometry are occurring the other two days. So this is the first year of three streams of math for them. So they're done. <laughs> the product's done, the bundle is available. If you bought any of the year six arithmetic terms or the elementary algebra terms or the practical geometry year two terms this past year, as we were producing them, you will get an email from us shortly with a coupon code. So you can purchase the bundles with all the updates and corrections at a discounted price because of what you've already purchased. And finally, Consumer Math Chapter 1 is also available now. This is this first chapter is only three weeks of lessons plus a review day. It's The lessons are once a week, and we'll be producing a chapter at a time for all our Year 7 Plus guides. So the second chapter will be coming out very soon, and the, there's new formatting. It's, they're going to have a student and teacher guide, and we hope you like it. We've also added new features to all the guides that we have created so far, and we want to tell you about that. We have heard from a lot of you that independent student work would be really, really helpful, and we hear you. We've wanted that as well. So part of our big projects culmination this summer was going through our year three through six arithmetic guides, as well as both the practical geometry guides. Send your thank yous to Emily again, please. And what we did was we took all the student responses and copied them into new um, documents without the answers included. And we tweaked just slightly some of the guides. You do not need to reprint any of the guides for years one through five. Um, just the year six updates are the ones that have major updates, which were in their pilot year this last year. But with these independent student uh, work documents, you can now print them. They're in your printables folder. And most lessons, there is a student response section. Your students can now check that page themselves and do it without you looking over their shoulder and just check it at the end because the answers have been removed. So we really hope you like it. Um, yeah, we're excited to use it ourselves this year. Okay, so to clarify yet again, we made some minor changes to the year one through five arithmetic guides, mostly accommodating the student response changes that we made to make more independent student work. So if you're using guides up until today that you've printed, there might be slight differences. They are minimal. They're not worth reprinting. We're not reprinting anything. We just want you to be aware that there might be some slight discrepancies now because of the independent student work that we created. There is one set of changes that you do need to be aware for the year five arithmetic guide. And that is that term one week four in the updated guide in your account now has brand new lessons. And the term two week two lesson three lesson is now optional with some slight rearranging and examining the national standards this summer, these changes need to be made. So you still do not need to reprint these guides. We will not be reprinting them, but we want to make you aware of this change specifically because this change was a big enough one to warrant current users of our guide to go back and print those lessons and add them in or file them away and make a note in your book to go to them when you use it again. So if you're one of the customers who has purchased this, you will also be getting an email about this change but we wanted to make you aware of it on this video as well. We've also compiled a new printing options guide. That is another pain point we hear from customers of how expensive it can be to print the guides. So 
Emily and I do things differently and we become aware of different op even more options than we knew about a year ago. So we have put together a printing options guide for you to look over to see what um, suggestions we have and what other people have talked to us about for printing those if that is your desired medium, which it is for me and Emily. And also, if you do not look in the important teacher helps folder, this is where you will find this document. This is also where you will find a bunch of teacher helps. Go check it out, please. Sometimes we get questions and we just redirect people to this folder. We have compiled um, several resources there that we consider vital to using our guides well. And another update, uh, we updated all the printables in all the guides. We love this update. We wanted to do this last summer and just with all the things we were doing, did not have the time. I'm not sure we actually had the time this summer, but we made it work. Um, so updated printables, if you print the guides that have been updated, like all the guides have been updated in the files. So in your, when you log into your account now, you will see a slightly updated version with the student responses. And the other change you will see is slight formatting differences in the introductions and the printing list for cardstock printables and just printables is now condensed. We compiled all our files as much as possible and streamlined it. So your current guide, because these are brand new. Yeah, your current guide, if you're watching this the day we put this out or relatively close to that, um, we'll have all the printables listed by title. That's fine. Those titles haven't changed, but we've condensed those into easier, uh, less documents with more pages. So the titles are all the same. They're now organized. We've made sure we've labeled every lesson heading or uh, worksheet heading with the lesson and the day and the week and all that to make it even easier to print and store these and use them with your kids. All right, we're on to our final part of this presentation and update. And now there are some action items for you. We have a new video on our shop page giving an overview of our guides and curriculum. So if you have not seen that yet, here's the link. You can go check that out. Speaking of new videos, we now have a YouTube account. So if you are not subscribed to us, please go do that. We barely use social media, both of us. so. YouTube is going to be the platform where we create videos and updates and we're not up for branching out beyond that at this point. So we would ask you to come subscribe and check out the shop page video. It's both on our YouTube channel and the shop page, giving the overview of our curriculum. I think that's it. All right. This is more just for you to be aware of. I don't know if there's an action item, but this is the category I put it in. Uh, we are most likely raising prices this fall. We are going to reevaluate our business. We have some new expenses with the growth of our business and some other factors. And so we just want to give you a heads up that prices will likely go up in the fall. If you cannot afford them, we have scholarship applications. Please use them. We don't want anyone not using our curriculum because of finances. But we're also business and have other things that we have to pay for beyond using our time to build these. So we just want to give you a heads up now and communicate clearly and upfront. So to celebrate having completed six years of guides and also going back to school and knowing prices will be going up this fall, we wanted to have a back to school sale. So the details are here on the slide and please go buy some guides if you're able. That is it. Thank you so much for watching this. We appreciate you and hope you have a wonderful school year.